Nom, 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 nom. I'm eating polo, sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I forget, or I don't forget, but I'm more like ignoring that I'm recording because I'm like, this is not the part of recording people are going to see. So I'm just going to be like, nom, nom, nom by myself. <laughs> I was going to introduce the game, but click. Inscription! I have been waiting so much to try this out. I was surprisingly a big fan of box shark roulette which you can of course also check out that people start recommending me like if you really enjoy this game you need to check out inscription and you know what i remember the time where like creators like mario play i was playing i was like what the heck is this it's just a card game i don't even want to watch this and then my taste in games grew tried box shark roulette loved it now i'm being told to try this out so here we are and i've been waiting i've been so excited i'm just me new game i'm just me new f new first time Be why does it say continue? But I'm, I haven't played before. But I haven't... But I haven't played before! Is this part of the game? This is so part of what is gonna F me. It's so part of the mind effing. It's gotta be. So we the oily head. Did I? <gasps> I forgot to take into accounting my fear of faces. That that literally gave me the spy and chills. Cause not cause that was scared. Because I'm expecting another challenger. It has been ages. Perhaps you have forgotten how this game is played. Can I move? No. Allow me to remind you. Can I use any other button? No. Click. Anywhere. Okay, click anywhere. Play the squirrel card. Oh, my hand is trembling. Play the squirrel card. Now play your stout. Do it. Oh, bang forward. With, bang forward. Stoat? What the f, f is a stoat? Is that like a ferret? Stoat costs one blood. Sacrifices must be made. That one costs two blood. Wolves require two sacrifices. You don't have enough. Ring the bell to end your turn and co okay. So the me like the, the cost in this game is blood. Your stoat stands unopposed. The number on the bottom left is his attack power one. Her stout dealt me one damage. I added it to the scale. If you win, you tip my side all the way down. Or you win if you tip my side all the way down. Like this. My turn. Before I click in, can we take a second to appreciate how ADHD friendly this tutorial is? Straight to the point, no dilly dally, explaining examples immediately. I love this. Oh gosh. Your stout stout stands in the way of my coyote. Oh, it's got a nomad. One my coyote dealt two damage to your stout and still got one heart left. That means your stout health please tell me how to pronounce that is two less. If a creature's health reaches zero, it dies. It's your turn again. You may draw from your deck or you may play or you may draw a squirrel. Okay, so we have a squirrel card deck, which is like to get blood sacrifices, or we may draw. But if I draw a squirrel now and then sacrifice the stout and the squirrel, then I would, how dull. I, I want the squirrel, right? Like that? And then go back? Can I, can I sacrifice? Oh, I can do everything in one round. Did that car just say, hey, huh, stop? Fear not to be sacrificed, but not removed from your deck. Okay. Its suffering was real, but you will see it again. That it? Oh, the wolf immediately attacked. Because you are learning, I will pass. 
Again, the choice, a random card from your deck or the certainty of a squirrel. Let's try a random card. River Snapper. You are lacking sacrifices for that creature. Okay, so ding. So I can sacrifice the wolf. Three damage dealt, three weights on the scale. Oh. Pass. I can't draw anything, so I might as well do the squirrel and then yeet it out. Right? It costs two blood, so I need... I can... Okay, so I need to wait now, right? Because it costs two blood, so I need another squirrel. You won this match. Oh, I wait with this. <laughs> I win! It won't all be so easy. Let me recall your story. I need to adjust my monitor real quick. Because I have a glare on the top that's annoying. Oh, yes. You were lost deep in the forest. Let me. A single path revealed itself. Two denizens of the forest approached your ten tentatively. Oh, big words! Two cards, so I can choose a card. That one. The caustic adder damage from its poison bite is always lethal. The undying cat sacrificed the poor beast does not kill it. Oh, cats do not die apparently. Only one may grace your poultry deck. Oh, so already now. So do I want a sacrifice that never disappears or always have blood? Or something that will kill something immediately? I actually, I'm gonna go with the cat because I think it's gonna be difficult with the limited turns to have enough blood. So I'm gonna go with the cat that never dies. Another creature joins your caravan. Okay, people right. I'm already loving this. Oh. Some of the creatures of the forest seem willing to follow you. You came across an abandoned sack. You found a squirrel in a bottle. Break in case of emergency. Okay. And have a second. Have like a squirrel. And not a useful implement. Implement, right? I'll allow you to tip the scales with it. Three is as much as you can carry. Okay. So I can have three items that I can use as like bonus things in the game itself. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Okay. Is that a battle? You were ambushed while crossing some rough terrain. So now we're playing. You sacrificed while I was sleeping. It was the right play. I get it. Maybe you'll help me. Play along for now. Did Seha don't kill me? You may now see my move ahead of time. See your moves ahead of time. Okay, so he's gonna play the wolf cup. A card bearing this sigil will grow into a more powerful foe. So I have to end the wolf cup. A card bearing this sigil will grow. Yeah, okay. But he's gonna play it there. But I have a boulder in the way, so I will probably... Hey! I took a tooth! Okay! A well learned point of damage! I didn't think you would really, you really do it. I wanted to I wanted to read. So the use a squirrel is created in your hand. A squirrel is defied as zero power. Okay, so it's just a cheat code to get squirrels in my hand. So I'm gonna go for the You are lacking sacrifices for the cat, but you do Oh wait, oh oh so the cat requires a squirrel there. And cat goes there. So now we have eternal cat. And I would like to play I can use this. Is it telling me it want me to do the snapper? You know what? Let's do that. Haya. Haya. Right? And then snapper, sacrifice, sacrifice. Snapper. Because I can't do it with the boulder. 
You require one blood. Really? <laughs> Here we go. I can. Okay, so as much I can, everything I can do, I can do. It's not mad. I'm going to do one action per turn. Just <laughs> crazy with everything you can. Okay. Here we go. And that was it, right? Then I can't do anything else, and I go ding. Yep. Mind the ambitious wolf cop. It ages swiftly. Yeah, I don't have anything in my hand, so... But I have a cat, so... Yeah? I got the regular wolf, and I can sacrifice the cat, and then I... I need one of these two dudes to do not go away before I can do anything. Because that cat... The wolf needs two. Yeah. Okay. Yeah? Yeah, it's not a wolf, a bat. The airborne bat flies over creatures to attack directly. With Maha, my bat flew right over your cat. Oh no. Wait. I have a free squirrel, so I might as well just do this. So now I have the two wolves, but I can't really do anything because the cat can't. Oh god, the cat. The cat can't attack it! Oh, I did. Oh, I, I should have placed the cat in front of the stump so I didn't have to worry about it like, being able to attack. Oh, no. Oh. Am I losing? The stump is gone. Not now. Draw a card for. Okay. There, place the squirrel. Go back. Squirrel, cat, go bye bye. Place there. Then it's one, two damage, and those are gonna attack each other. Oh, we outweighs. Oh, wait, so we can keep going. <gasps> oh. I have to draw a squirrel because I don't have any space for anything else, so. Haya? Oh, like that. And they don't have any more cards, so I can just keep going. Oh, this is intre This is dangerously interesting. You prevailed, and trek it onwards past onwards onwards past the new bloodied terrain. What about the stout? The stout, however you pronounce it. But talk to me. Like keep playing the game. Just follow along for now. A wolf cup. Or an inexpensive, if fleeable, flying creature. Fleeable? What does that mean? Okay, so the wolf cub will become a big wolf after one turn. I I want to try the sparrow. I want to try the sparrow. What do you do? You stumbled into some strange stones in the mist. You were compelled to choose worthy sacrifice, one that will be lost forever. So I can choose a card to lose for... Oh, I should have done the cub. The game knew I wouldn't do that. I want to keep the cat. That cat is smart. Yep. <laughs> you looked upon your... Menagerie and selected a healthy host. Pick me? What an honor. So it got the ability. A ghastly spectacle, but the soul of the sparrow now lives in his, in his stout. Stout. This is good. This is so good. Ah! It made me burn, I'm sorry. But hold my totem, it inscribes in my canine cards with the airborne sigil. <laughs> He's completely insane, you see that, right? He care for the rules. Pathetic, really. Enough. Only keeps me around to watch me suffer. Okay, let's take a look at this field real quick. So, what is the... A card bearing the sigil will strike an opponent directly, even if there's a creature opposing it. Okay, so he's gonna play that there and there. So I'm gonna need to play something here and here to end. Okay. So I have a squirrel. I need to play the squirrel. Yeah, I need to play the squirrel. 
And I'm feeling like, because that that means we're going to go straight for the, the guy as well. So we need to place this where the other two aren't going to be placed. Yeah. Back on the board. Why are you talking? You're flying. You cannot draw a card on your first turn. Okay, ding. Now they're being played. My totem has granted the coyote power of flight. Uh... Oh, I have a free nom nom. I need that one gone. I need squirrel. I have one squirrel. I need. I actually need, I need a secondary squirrel. Now. And that one. So. And they're both a bad thing, so it doesn't really matter where I decide to focus my attack. Let's see, because you get you get three. What did you do? That's one. You just got a lot of health. Let's go for. Oh, it's only one. Their cost. And well, let's try. Let's try the snapper then. Yeah. Bang. Air. Oh, that wolf is not good. I only have one wolf, so I'm forced to do. A squirrel, unless I hope for the cat. Yay! So I need to play the cat. No, not sec. Oh wait, I have to sacrifice it. Nay, and I don't have one. Oh shoot, I can't do anything. I forgot. Uh oh. Oh, oh, I'm in trouble. Oh, I'm losing. I lost. You've lost. Using this as a learning opportunity may be the only way to migrate my disappointment. Mitigate my disappointment. Get up. Get up from the table. Fetch me the candlestick from atop the barrel beside the door. Oh, so I didn't have a choice. I had to. The candlestick. Okay. Ah! Ah! I can see his framing a bit. Ooh. The candlestick from atop the door? The Bring it here. Oh, you got some cool. <gasps> now sit back down. Let me explain something to you. He's my life. It was one of the two mistakes you can make here. If it make another, if you make another, I must sacrifice you. Ah! Now where were we? <laughs> So next card. Oh, so turn all cards. We already got a snapper. Elk. You fly the elk, it moves faster after attacking. Ooh, interesting. The monster is grisly. It's from, it's form speaks enough. Ooh, okay, so we already got a snapper who's great at defense. I don't understand fully yet. At the end of the owner's turn, a card bearing the sigil will move in the direction it's scribed in the sigil. So it will change position. I don't think I'm going to be very good at remembering how to do that. But that one is going to be like three. You know what? Let's try the elk. I want to try something new. I don't mind if I lose this entire tutorial the first time and I try all over. We're here to learn. But this is good. And by the way, something I intended on being an actual series. So we are... Oh, crap. I forgot. I will be playing this more than once for you guys. Oh. Okay. So choose the fire or the thing I don't know what is. The fire is up there. But there's also a thing. You know what? I'm oh, that's a sacrifice. I don't want to sacrifice. I don't have enough cards. Oh! You came across a small group of survivors. Faces shrunken from starvation. They huddled around the campfire. They looked upon your group of creatures and beckoned. Come, warm one of your creatures by the fire, one said. The thing here is, yeah, even though we're playing with cards, they're telling the story as if these critters are actually our companions. So the cards are just symbolism for us actually using them. Warm it by the fire that will enhance its power, said another. You notice one of the survivors wiping drool from their mouth. They want to eat it. Am I forced? <laughs> hmm. Hmm? Night! The fire warmed the poor stout, enhancing its power. One of the survivors reached towards it. 
Another gnashed their teeth. Without a word, you pulled the stout away from the fire and left. So we enhanced it. And it survived because we were lucky. This time. Well, no one... There is a way out for both of us. It's somewhere in this foul cow. Oh my god, the stout's helping us to escape. Yeah, because we're trembling. We don't want to be here and play. We're forced. Okay, so little guy is helping the Grand Fur. Mighty Leap, a card bearing this sigil, the this, this shield and the... The wing, I'm sorry. Um, will block in opposing creatures for airborne... Okay, so if it has an airborne sigil, it can stop them. Like birds. If I go forward, we know the Grizzly is going to be played immediately. What? Well, we need to play some cards. Hi, not yet. Oh, we had a cat as well. Maybe the cat first, so we have unlimited life, technically, you know. And no pulling on first turn. Because now we can sacrifice a cat that will never be sacrificed. And... There. This spot? You sure? Nay, I'm not sure anymore when you say it like that. Can I change? No? Am I gonna lose now? Because I, I, I figured he plays the grizzly. Mm. Because now I have to do this. And do that. Wow, seriously? I'm sorry, I have to. Oh, now the wolf's gonna go bye-bye. Oh, wait, I can sacrifice the wolf as well for that. Ugh. No. I, oh, I need to practice this. Oh, I'm, I'm not good at these kind of things typically. Because now that one is gone. We need to pull a new card. Another wolf. But I can't play either of them. Because I only have one. Now I'm gonna lose. I lost. Darn! Oh well, only one way to learn. Alas, it is time for us to perish. Ha! You aren't dead yet. This isn't purgatory. Though you may think of it that way. Before you expire, I must ask you a favor. I would like a memento. Your very own death card. It's quite plain at the moment, isn't it? We will work together to amend that. I need to write down the time for epilepsy warning one second. I want this to be the perfect memento of you. Um, here are some cards from your mediocre deck. We can put them to good use. Please use a card to draw the cost from. The cost is the same. Yeah? Uh, power and health. Sure. Now choose a card from which we will extract the sigils. Did we just create a card that cost two, can never be killed, and has two attack and four health? Or it cannot be sacrificed, it will not die through sacrifice. My name is Camila. Answer? There is now but one final matter. The portrait. Are you ready? No. I thought for a second it was going to connect the, that, that there's a camera. Here we go again. Another challenger. So now we're a different character, but we can pull the card of me. Perhaps you understand Bones. The game is called Bones. An opossum. The resourceful opossum costs two bones. Oh no, that's different to two bones. 
You can gain bone when one of your creatures perishes for any reason. Hey. Okay. okay, I need to play the squirrel at least. And then go back. And we can play the, 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 the homie. And he is now neutralized. Mr. Stout. From the death. And now we got a bone. Okay. You will not lose this until it is spent or the battle ends. Okay. That would be it, right? I didn't pay attention to the to the to the rattler. I should have done that. Oh yeah, I should have done that. Woohoo! I should have done that. I did not pay attention. Um that it? And now I'm gonna lose because it's gonna attack like oh wait, no. You also have that. I'm thinking what what was the special the you're lacking the bones. Okay, it's E E and then, uh. Yeah? And then the possum boy? There? There. Uh huh. Bullfrog. Cost oh the bullfrog is good. It's a it's a new and it costs one. One blood. Save it for now. Okay, so now we saw it all over the map. I see. Oh, I forgot your figurine. Get up and fetch it for me. It's beside the safe. He's. Um. I can choose my own, or no, I have to do the front one with the umbrella. Why is the? Oh. Oh, what are the? Oh, oh, you know what? Oh shoot. Let's not keep him waiting, huh? Yeah. Let us continue. <laughs> one. The unkillable cockroach, he returns to your hand after dying. That is smart. In the fairy's rattler, a, brinch, a brittle creature once passes monstrous fangs. So yeah, it's cheap, but ouch. It costs a lot of bone. A meager coyote, but what did you expect for only four bones? Okay, these all cost bones. So do we want something that returns to our hand, even if it's dead because that could but that, it costs four bones every time that's going to be a while then i'm thinking the rattler let's try something else i'm not really great at building cards and decks but let's try you know you're free to get up again keep your blood flowing i am no tyrant you may stand wherever the map is on when the map, i'm allowed to walk where the map is unrolled it allows me to time to plan your next encounter but do keep your hands off my possessions so it's like if I want to take a look, I I can. So there's a clock. We have this board of some cards. We have that which I'm not allowed to touch. The door out. A squirrel with a knife. I'm not allowed to touch. I don't dare touch. There's one. Ca I kind of. I don't want to touch the key. Let's, let's not for now. Let's be smart this time. Let's actually try next time. What this? A card bearing the sigil. Oh, it's the encyclopedia. Okay, that's smart. Okay, let's try. Let's continue. Hiya! Backpack! A powerful item. Turn this and I'll skip my turn. Oh! A rocky may get you out of a hard place. Yes, we already have one of those, but skip his turn or save my ass. Save my ass. Some bone tokens for a rainy night. Yeah. Feeling overburdened enough with free full items? You carry on. Okay, so yeah, now we have a little bit of everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, this is so interesting. I'm so... Ooh, it's good. Let's try it. Are you smart or something? He usually doesn't even bother teaching about bones. All right, here's a tip. I saw a past victim writing a passcode in the rule book. We have to go check the rule book. 
Okay, let's see. Um, coyote, sparrow. Sparrow's gonna go wee! -hee! So that's two lives. So we need to end the sparrow. We need to end the sparrow. And that one is safe for that for, for a while. So we need to end the sparrow somehow. Uh, we have a squirrel. We need to play it because I give a card. And we have stout. Okay, sacrifice you. Stout is only one. No. That's a stump. But still. Two attacks, and then you're gone. Okay. Add or something? F. How many... Uh, oh, oh, I already did it. Two... Wait, how many is there? Can I play this? No, there's five. Okay. I guess that's it. Yeah, because now that's being played, and that did that, and now we're gonna end it the next round. That's okay. Uh, radar reports, uh, we, we need a... We need a... We need a shrimp. I was about to... <laughs> shrimp. <laughs> We need a, uh, a dude. That's just dumb. So might as well just play the card. And then next round, we pull one. Yeah. Hiya! We pull one of these guys. Two. We do the rattler. So we can get rid of the coyote. Yep. Bang, bang! I need... Squirrel. I see where it is, the way this is going. I concede. You may accept my surrender, or you may finish this match the slow way. I accept your surrender. He knew he was losing. Because I don't gain anything from continuing, you know, per se. Okay, the omnipotent molded burrows emerge to block a landborn attacker. Oh, it blocks a landborn. <laughs> The apotho apothosized goat. The truest offering. Sacrificing grants. Oh, we, we need the goat. That's me. Okay, we got no reason to suffer or sacrifice to make cool. Oh, that one I haven't seen before. Let's do that one up there. We already used some of the items, so. Oh! A gust from this may lift your creatures into the air, if only for a turn. Oh, to save them! To save them. Let's try it. Next. I don't know what this is. Let's try it. Oh, oh it's a totem battle. Oh! <laughs> Ever look in the rule book? No, I didn't! There's definitely passcodes scrolled in there. Next one. They were looking up the bullfrog's sigil. Okay, so we need to look at the bullfrog in the book after this, if I don't forget. Okay, we have a squirrel. Might as well play it. Uh, and then these are not gonna touch me or like it doesn't matter that i play the boulder because it's not gonna help me at, at all but we can sacrifice this guy and then place him here total misplay why oh i per space that i apparently did something why is that a misplay Why is he... Why, why is... Why... What? Let's take the boulder and place there for now. Take the squirrel so we at least have something we can sacrifice until next round. Because at least we're safe from the coyote. Uh, I need a creature. Bullfrog. He's gonna fly over any creature anyway. I want to end the bird. So here. And I think we might die if I don't do something. So let's pull a tooth. Ow. There we go. Now I need something that attacks too. Uh, so if I take... What, what, what did I do again? I was like super cool. Yeah. So if I take a squirrel... 
You have me there. I surrender. Okay, that's really interesting. The frog. Is that not it? Is that not the rule book? Wait, oh, so that's the code? Wait. Seven, three. Is that the... Wait. Like, am I allowed to do this? Is that gonna get angry? I wasn't sure if I would ever escape that I encrypt. I p it's the third round. Start round. The Thunder Wolf. The madness must end. Put that away. Oh. Is he gonna get angry at me? Thank you! Sorry! What is all this? Are there like puzzles? Oh, what use? Huh. Are they supposed to be similar? Is that why? Somehow? Somehow they're supposed to be similar? I don't understand how though. That's maybe not for now. Let's try and finish this, okay? Yeah, let's see if we can finish this. That, that, that's the first one here. Good day, hi, hello. You were stopped along the way by a trapper looking to liquidate his pelts. There was something uncanny about the appearance, but you were quickly distracted by his wear. Cares to look at my pelts? The trapper dealt in teeth, which uh, the type collected from battle. They are gained by dealing damage greater than what is needed to win a match. Oh, take a belt for your charge. Thank you. See, the, see the quality. So, if I decide to not accept him surrendering any excess damage from the battle, I will gain bones from. I can use this currency. You're leaving already? I don't... Uh, please, consider more pellets. I don't have anything! Sure. You'll need more than tea for that one. Thanks for your business. The man assured you of the value of the pellets. They appear to be useless in a fight. But he mentioned that the trader further down the path would, be re would reward you for them. Which for later on. So if I take the pellets, I should aim for... A trader, which I don't know where it is. I don't know where the trader is. How many items do we have to fan only? Already pull the tools and use the boulder. I don't know where the trader is. I don't know which symbol it is. I'm just gonna go this one because I don't know what that one is. That would probably have been the one. The goat. Yes. I need the goat. Uh, I want the goat. I have to fan. Let's do squirrel. Next, battle time. I don't know what the two water things are as well, or the drops. I don't know what they are. <laughs> you again. Indeed, our friend freed me. <laughs> well, I basically told him them how to do it. You got a plan? We have another friend here. You've got to be. I wouldn't call him a friend. But I suppose we are in deep this time. This is really interesting. Oh, this is really interesting. Okay, let's take a look. He's playing a sparrow and a sparrow. A sparrow and a sparrow. They're gonna whoop. Anyways, so two. I'm not allowed to, to, to do anything really. Wait, and what did you cost? You cost bones. You attack one, you attack three and one, one. And he's gonna be like me. Anyhow, I'm going to do it, do it. Fine. Ding. 
Now the sparrows are here. Porcupine. Porcupine, what are you? Once car bang the sizzle stuck the striker, then it dealt. Oh, so it's it will pe it was ding, but also hurt itself. Is that how it works? I need sacrificing things. Yeah, so if I... What did it go to again? Uh, a black goat is defiled as zero power, one health worthy sacrifice. But it gives... Yeah, it gives three bloods instead though, right? Doesn't matter. I'm gonna put this guy down. Can I sacrifice it just for the sake of sacrificing? No. E -e. Then I'm gonna do this. Place a squirrel. Go back. Kill, kill. Place wolf. Because now I have a lot of bounce. How much did you deal? One damage. That's one, one. How much health did you have? You had two. Yeah. Let's go. Back at the game. <laughs> Okay, we don't have anything in our hand. Um, yeah, me. Have to wait though. Sparrow, ow. So now we have to try. Now I might have to sacrifice. What did you do again? The creature opposing card. This sigil loses one power. Okay, uh, so it, it doesn't end it, but it loses power. Oh, yeah, it does attack as well. So it has zero power. Oh, that was smart then. Okay, so now I can decide to sacrifice the wolf to try and get me in play. Yeah, to try and get me in play because I have lots of health and I can keep sacrificing myself for one or two blood. Yeah? No, oh, let's draw a card. Yeah. The rabbit pelt, which I couldn't use for anything. So, I'm gonna... I wanna play me, so I'm gonna sacrifice the wolf. Because I get two blood, right? Yeah. Sacrifice it. Oh, no, it's only one. Oh, never mind. Oh, shoot. That doesn't give anything either. Uh, nah. Then I should wait around. Otherwise, I have to it, it sacrifice... You know what? Wait around. Bang, bang, bang. Oh! Oh. Hmm. Let's see. Choose not a specific beast, but decide the cost that you wish to pay. What? Uh, let's do two blood. A random card cost of two. Okay. Oh, that one that kills immediately. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I take it. That's good. That's good. That's fine. Immediate nom nom. See, we're this close. We're gonna finish this. Okay. A group of starving survivors stood around the dying campfire. There is room for a crazy round the fire, one said. The warm fire will enhance its health, said another. One of the survivors and nothing could stop licking their lips. So, survive, we get two health. That one. Pick something else. No. Is it because they already got like a... They got like a shadow. I can't use them. Is that why? Uh, Rattler? <laughs> Stop. You? <laughs> nope. Wait, what? You? <laughs> Please, no. It's because I'm clicking the wrong button. There. Yeah, I clicked the wrong button all the time, so I'm a dumb dumb. <laughs> I was just teasing him, apparently. <laughs> Oops. My boss battles are high stakes. Test your aptitude. Okay, with one flame, you'll either overcome them or die. Free not, I will let you keep the smoke. Huh? The trees seem too close around you as wait. The trees seem to close in around you as the chill mist descended. 
In the distance, you could hear the clanging of metal and stone. A hobbled figure stood in your path. Hee hee twas the prospector. What does the smoke do? It gives bone. Uh, if, uh, what? When a car brings the sigil, four bones are rewarded instead of one. Okay, four bones. And it costs nothing to really play. Okay. Then might as well. Wait, I need to check. Uh, wolf, what the, the, oh, the mule is gonna move. What is it gonna need the packing mule for? Okay, we're gonna sacrifice you and you and place and place a card there. So many bones, yeah. There. Bah. Two, four, six bones. Squirrel, play. Rattler, there. That one is thick. Why is that card thick? Sacrifice squirrel for the coyote. Awesome. Cost two. One, one. That could end that one. So. There. There. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. The music. Ah, god damn it. Rabbit pilled. Ah. I don't think we have a choice. What happens when it reaches the end? I hope you didn't think I would be that easy. Yeah, I, oh, so I just technically one, one win, right? <laughs> There's gold in them cards. Yeah. yeah. Ah! No! Gold, I've struck gold. And you got a bop oh. uh, I Yeah, I need something to attack now. I, I got me. What does the gold do? What does it go do? Rabbit, uh, uh, it just moves. But is that it? Bloodhound, uh, three health, and I I do two damage, but I have lots of health. So to, you are stacking sacrifice. Your gold nugget can't be sacrificed. But what do I do then? I I can't do anything. Eat him. Oh, so I have to wait now. to wait now okay so he has when opposing creatures place upon them to space a card bearing decisions will move to that empty space i need um i need something to play my card so i need to do this oh i need to do the go uh, okay sacrifice the goat to place there and then to sacrifice that one for me please me there because you know, the dog's gonna be in my way regardless and yeah, that's okay that's okay <laughs> we need a creature honestly <laughs> he's doing the prospector again easy boss the mule's key what oh, is that's all i could do right now right gone then I- then next time I should be able to get it, right? I need this. Squirrel, play. Back. Squirrel, sacrifice. Play, stout. Keep me alive! And the love- Oh! Cards! Oh! Cards! Dang! Nabbit, my mule! Oh, that's cool! Adder. The wolf cup. Okay, so now we have- Oh, crap. Uh, beaver? Mole? Let me see. Uh, wait, one second. We need... Uh... 
if I draw, that's one, two. That one's gonna die immediately. I need something to kill that, and that's one, two. What does you do? When a card bring the sigils, play the damage created on each empty adjacent place. The damage is defined as zero power, two health. Okay, that's smart if I don't... Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do that. Oh, no, I shouldn't have done that. Oh, no, then I have to sacrifice my own character. Which is fine! No, wait. Okay, squirrel, go back. I want to be your sacrifice, sacrifice, place there. My character stays. No dams, that's fine. No dams for me, that's okay. Go back. Hiya! Allow me to light your candles once more. I won't be killing you quite yet. Okay, so boss battle equal more. You're the first in a while to overcome a boss. As a reward, you are granted an opportunity to select a rare card. Use carefully. The uninspiring gek. Perhaps you can find a use for it. This level of brutish strength needs no explanation. The Urak Urayuli. Poor abandoned child. It does not die when sacrificed, but do you have the heart to try? Oh, I am so curious about the gecko, the gek. I'm sure we can evolve it into something. So we have, so we have my own card that's not sacrificeable problems. I'm gonna do it with gek. Let's see what happens. With some of the prospector's pickaxe still ringing your ears, you carried on. Hmm. And now we're here! Wait, the rank smell of rotten mold permit permeated the humid air. Every step forward was answered by some nearby sleeper slither. You tread cautiously into the wetlands. That's the first episode! Or the first part! I am loving this. Oh my god, I am loving people were correct. If I liked Box Shark Roulette, I would love this, and people are correct. We are definitely going to play more of this, but this was the first episode. We managed to do the tutorial. We managed to do the first boss. Let me know if you have some tips, some tricks, maybe something that's not going to spoil me, but maybe some good hinders for me to try and remember in the future. And that would be it. Thank you so much for joining. I will see you guys next time for the episode two of Inscription. Bye.